Hey everybody, it's Angela. Welcome back to my channel. Look where I'm at today, the TaylorMade headquarters here at Carlsbad, California, also known as The Kingdom. Today I'm going to be doing a full club fitting and I'm going to look at everything that they have to offer because I am now switching to TaylorMade. And you guys are going to follow me along for the entire day. I'm going to show you guys everything that I'm going to do, an entire overview of my day and experience here at The Kingdom. So if you guys like this video, share, like, subscribe, and let's get started. <laughs> Bigger than me. <laughs> nervous anymore after I hit a couple shots. I'm fine now. <sighs> but you were nervous. I was nervous because <laughs> Dwayne, he actually fitted me when I, the first time I came here and I was 13 and I was just like so blown away that they had a place like this for golfers and I don't know, it's just flashback memory to the, my good old junior golf days and how simpler golf was and how I try to complicate things now nowadays. Even in my game, I don't play as much as I, do, I did when I was playing but you know, as a teacher now, I have to remember, I have to work on my game too. I think I need some work, not as far as like making my ball better, but just having more fun swinging it, not being so methodical or analytical about it and having fun just being out here in the game. So that's how I feel right now. And I probably need to go back to my coach because I need help. My swing sucks right now. <laughs> Ooh, you have a nice one. Let's start right here, please. Thank you. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, that was nice. You know, I missed it. That was nice. <laughs> now that one. Oh, yeah, I like this. <laughs> that. Even that, I like that. Okay. I'm getting tired already <laughs> and it's been what like 20 balls <laughs> and I shouldn't say that but I am because this is what happens when people get fitted like I just want the best shot out there and I'm gonna give it good power so I'm over hitting it like I would never hit this hard or this fast when I'm playing around so I need to like tone myself down and I think he noticed that when I'm just trying to huff and puff it out there so when you do do fittings don't go all out all the time. Do it like your normal percentage because that's what's going to look like on the course because if my ball speed's different, my swing speed's different than it would be on the course, then I might get a different club. So I need to just go. <laughs> that felt good. I mean, that one began here. Less loss, we got more speed. Now we're at where we should be. Fairways are wet that morning. You get on the one click. Playing out in the desert and you're getting a lot of run. Yeah. Click it down. Okay. That was fun. Thanks, Dwayne. Let me see your seven. A new P770s and a true temper shaft. Oh, that was great, miss. I like it. 770. Awesome. Steel fiber. So I have gone fitted for the stealth driver. Three wood, five wood, and four hybrid. I used to have a three hybrid, but I changed to four. And then I'm gonna get the P770s, five iron to pitching wedge. Definitely a fan of all the clubs so far. I'm very impressed. Oh! All of a sudden you're open and then trying to find square again. What? Your tendency changed. Now you were left edge to dead square. Oh. I would mess with not having 
not using the line. I do put like simpler without the line when I practice, so it makes sense. Okay, cool. But just you can kind of look at overall, this difference is half a degree. Mm -hmm. This is like slight toe hang as well, I like that. Yeah, that's actually in the spider, that's the one that most of the players use, is that little sign, mm -hmm. because it rotates like the blade. Yeah. Ooh. I, I like this more important, like the colors from, you know, the white and the black line, and then just like this part where it just looks like it's in like a little bowling alley. So the first one I put in your hand, yeah. but I stopped being shut. Yeah. I'm like, okay, that's not gonna help us. Yeah. I got the new spider head. That's not even out yet. It's probably gonna come out in March, and now I'm gonna try the wedges. So it's important for me to see the bounce and the face, the look of it, the feel. It's most importantly, the grind though, because they produce different spins. Grabby, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Now try that out of a thicker line. I still like the, how it spins so much more easier. Look at those. Mm. Which one has a higher bounce angle? That one? All right, that's my low bounce wedge. Ugh. Exactly. <laughs> So, but it has a low surface area interacting with the ground, so mm. it plays like a low bounce. Mm. So a wider sole plays like a higher bounce. Mm. So it's really about how much sole is interacting with turf. Tell me about that one, how it went through. Mm, how it. you made it, but how did it go through the turf? Mm, easy, Okay. It was, but it was thin. Yeah, I don't have to try. I just swing. Now that one, same shot. Okay. Whoa, that's spun fast. Right. A good thing. Okay. Any new wedge is gonna spin more than what you have in your bag. Yeah. Just because the grooves are new. Yeah. These couple these brand new grooves. We've done everything we can to give them, get them spinning mm -hmm. from groove shape to little micro grooves between the grooves. Mm. Then the, the third part is raw face. So these faces rust. Yeah. That, so you can imagine if you put a chrome plating on, a, on top of a sharp edge groove, you're actually making it duller. Oh. And it's slippery. Make sense? Right? This is more slippery than this. Yeah. Well, so the raw rusted face. It's like sandpaper. Mm. You get more grab. Yeah. Where we off of normalize, it's not. It's negligible. Yeah. A couple hundred RPMs off of that. It's five or six hundred RPMs more spin. Doing all that stuff, but yeah, grinding's a whole other skill set. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was so 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 nice. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> this wedge is awesome. The 58 low bounce and the chromed milled grind three, whatever that means. But this wedge, I literally don't have to try it. It already spins and it's just like so nice that I can control this. But it's definitely going in the bag. It feels like butter going through the golf ball. Even on tight lies, rough lies, bunker, it's like so diverse. You guys are gonna see me doing a lot of stuff with these wedges. Hopefully I'll make more pars too. <laughs> But these are awesome. I've never had a wedge like this in a really long time. So definitely a big fan. Chrome finish, so it doesn't glare in you know in the face based on the sun. But this is totally a I don't know. I was almost speechless. Very impressed today. All right, you guys. That was my video with TaylorMade. I am so tired. I hit so many golf balls, but it was super fun. Their technology with their new carbon wood head. Um, oh my gosh, I'm literally speechless right now. I liked every single product that I hit. Um, I was very amazed with the specs that they have, the options, the 
versatility that they have for every type of golfer. So even if you're a beginner golfer to advanced golfer, you have they have a club basically for everybody. Um, and that's hard to say for a golf company, but definitely very impressed with the long clubs. The driver to hybrid was probably my favorite. Second favorite was putter and wedges, of course. That was amazing. I mean, I basically just said all of the clubs were my favorite, um, but I had a blast coming out here to the kingdom is very nostalgic coming back here again because this is actually where I got my first club fitting as a junior and it was just really awesome to come back here to basically my home company which is TaylorMade so I'm so happy I signed with them if you guys like this video please share like subscribe and thank you guys so much for watching we'll see you guys in the next video bye